MSC Criminology and Security Studies is a two-year course, uh, the two-year program. We have, or we all know that security is a, a very sensitive issue and topic. So some of the MSC courses takes one year, some 18 months. This one is two years, which is complete four semesters. So uh, here are the details. You have, these are the courses for the first semester, and you are expected to carry or to earn thirteen units from this semester. You could carry more. Like here, we've carried it uh, sixteen, which gives us an edge to if fulfill one and still graduate. Um, one which does not include the core course anyway. Mm. If they are all core courses, then it would include the core course. So you have two unit course, you pay 2500 for the course materials and uh, 2000 naira as exam fee. Sum them up, you have this 4500 here. Sum this up, you have 5000 everywhere. So in the end, you'll be paying 65,000 for your first semester. This first compulsory fee here is 36,000. Uh, made it first because second one will be 18,000. But well, this one includes results verification and all that, but the second one does not. The result, your results and screening happens only once in National Open University, not twice. Okay, then we. Um, second semester, this is first semester. Second semester, you're expected to pass or uh, earn 12 units. We've registered only 12. If there are more courses in your portal, it's advisable to add more. But remember that the more you add, the more money you have to pay for the course material for the exam, which is roughly extra 5,000 for one more course. But then you will have the opportunity to proceed with your studies if you fill that one. Or any other one that is equivalent to your unit, you may just have to proceed with your studies. You don't have to uh, re rewrite that course. You don't. Okay. So your composite fee has come down to 18,000 instead of 36, and your total fee for this semester is 38,000. It's just 12 units. So uh, it's 38,000. So we move to the third semester, which is second year. Then we have uh, five courses as well, uh, sensitive courses. We're expected to pass 15 units and you've registered 15. No mistakes, you have to pass all of them, that's what it means. You pay 3,000 each for the material because they are 33 units and you pay 2,000 for exams, which sums up to 43,000 with the uh, 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 compulsory fee of 18,000. Then your final semester, some people stay longer if they had issues of carryover or they mistakenly left some courses unregistered. So I'm making this video to this video to eliminate some of those errors. Okay, so you have only two courses with your project, which still sums up to 12 units, and 12 is required, which means no errors too. You have to pass all of them, and you are paying 68,000 this time because the project is 40,000. So that's how it is spread. Now, here we have 52 units required of your minimum of 52 out of 55, which means you cannot fill more than one course. If you fill one, it could be waived for you. But more than that, you are not going anywhere. You'll be coming back and you'll be paying this 18,000 compulsory fee to rewrite the ones you filled.
So currently, have you and that's total credits and are the ones you've passed? Have you end up to 52 units? Have you passed up to 52 units? If you have, that means you are a graduate and your name would come up in the next graduation list. Definitely. So this is the policy surrounding MSc Criminology and Security Studies. The courses, the credit units, and the fees associated with them.